Better get it. We're gonna be rubbing some sticks together otherwise. Hell yeah, girl. We're awfully proud of you. Laura, you've been through a lot, baby. I see you shivering. I see you're cold. I know you want to cry, but you ain't crying, though. Be proud of you. I'll be honest with you, so far I'm really invested in the character. She's, um... She seems fragile, yet... Um... Motivated to survive, for sure. She seems human. She, she doesn't seem superhuman in any way, which makes her a lot easier to relate to. Here's the soon-to-be world-famous archaeologist, Lara Croft, in her native habitat. She's on the hunt for the lost kingdom of Yamatai, home to the fabulous Himiko, mythical sun queen, and ancestor of yours truly. <laughs> Sam, this is serious. Oh, sweetie, I know. I'm just trying to lighten the mood here. Everyone's so on edge. What are you so worried about? I'm close to something. I'm sure of it. I just don't know if the others will listen. Or even if they should. Lara, you know this stuff better than anyone. Seriously. I'm not just saying this to make you feel better. I trust you. Roth trusts you. You got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay. Okay. Take a break from what? Sitting time. there? Thanks. She's not always this serious, you know. Come on, take oh, him. No, oh. no, we got to. How can you suggest I'm not serious about this expedition, Laura? It's not just Sam's family funding us. I put my savings on the line too. We've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamatai. No one believes Yamatai is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamatai. I've talked to Roth about this. There's no point in following in other people's footsteps, Dr. Whitman. I refuse to bet my reputation on your hunch. I'm the lead archaeologist here. And when were you last in the field with a TV crew behind you? Got 30 years experience, two PhDs, one in East Asian history. So why don't you just stick to boats, Mr. Grimm? Ship, Dr. Whitman. It's a ship. Don't need a PhD to know Look, that. Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. Lara, my little bird. I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place has a bad energy. Bad storms, more like, makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. <laughs> Sign me up. The stories about Queen Himiko say she could summon storms. Myths are usually based on some version of the truth. What if Yamatai was somewhere in the Triangle itself? Well, look, this is the satellite imagery from inside the Dragon's Triangle. That doesn't look good. If it's wet, I can sail on it. Oh, don't tell me you're seriously cons- Reyes is right. We don't have the funds to piss about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. It's my decision. We're going into the Dragon's Triangle. Why am I even here? So you can be a douchebag is the only answer I have for you. Don't, don't know that I care for that fella. Real quick, let's see if I can, uh... Turn on some uh, subtitles. There we go. Beautiful. Cool. Well, let's let's move on. I can't just sit here. I've got to find something to eat. Girl, you hungry? Can't really eat these sticks and sticks and stones over here, huh? Let's go find some food, huh? So, I mean, from what I'm seeing, guys, like the 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 the, the foliage, the the particle systems, the, the mist, everything like that, the floating particles in the air, the leaves falling down, all look fantastic. There's a lot going on just in this picture right here. Just in this picture alone, there's just a ton going on. And I'm talking about we're only rendering maybe 30 feet. We're not even rendering like an entire vista or a mountain range, anything like that. So there's definitely a lot going on, and I'm really surprised at the... What the fuck is that? Oh, there's fucking butterflies? Oh, there's a deer down there. Holy shit. Oh, those are not butterflies. They're birds. 
That's a god dang bird. I'm going to eat you, son. Better watch out. I'm hungry. I'm going to feed Laura. That is my main oh, objective. God. What's going on here? Wait. I can use that bow. I suppose I can. I suppose I can use that bow. Well, that was awfully fluid. I, I kind of, with that first time I did it, I didn't think that was going to be very, very fluid the way that she crawled up. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it again. Let's do that again. But that definitely works out quite well. She's gotten a lot quicker at getting up. It looks actually really good. Oh, oh come on, girl. I can do this. Hell yeah, you can. You're going to have to do it. We need it. How else are you going to be catting this Epidane if we don't get you this motherfucking bow? Get it? Pull it? Ow! Holy shit, that looked horribly painful. Let's see if this thing still works. Just remember Roth's training. You can have the best. All right, so left trigger, left trigger brings it up. It won't mean a thing if you can't focus. The key to using any weapon is focus. Some arrows here. Let's get these. So oh yeah, we got five arrows. I kind of really like that focus. That's really cool the way it does that. I can get out of it. I'll if you if you guys could see it, it's almost like a like a wave that starts from us, like almost like a I don't know, like a weird visual sonar. When I hit it, and it just rolls out like a like a I don't know, like a water wave in every direction. I don't know what that means. I, I wish I would. I really wanted that to come out a lot more. Uh, academically but it just didn't and i apologize <laughs> just came out water wave i don't know what else to say i hope for some better than that but it just did not come out better than that all right so how do i sneak oh, that's not what i wanted to do yep fuck that bird it's 20 experience for shooting a fucking macaw in the back of the head awesome sauce More arrows. Shit, yeah, girl. I feel like straight up. Straight up Assassin's Creed with that shit. Shit. God damn it. Apparently you can't just hold that forever. Did I get it? No way I shot that bitch. Hell yeah I did, son. Ooh, girl, it's going to be dear tonight. Holy shit, it's still alive. Oh, that's gruesome. But something you guys, something you guys don't know about me is that I grew up in... Uh, East Texas and my entire family is all about deer hunting and guns and bows and arrows and shooting animals and killing them and all kinds of crazy shit. And I have never, ever in my entire life ever shot an animal. And I never could do it when I was a kid. They used to take me hunting all the time and I, I would have a gun with me and I would sit down on the, on the, uh, the deer stand and I, I would... All I could do is watch them. The deer are cute. They're cute as shit. They're nasty as hell, though. Deer are nasty-ass animals. But, uh... <clears throat> They're just cute, man, and I just could never ever bring myself to kill one. Back to camp. Hell no, I'm not ready to go back to camp. All right, partner. You won't always have some fancy gadget to tell you where you are. This motherfucker goes roll up like this. To read the land and the Damn stars, it! You'll always be able to find your way home. Damn it! This dude is not paying attention. You dick. That guy was all up in my business and I couldn't get his ass. Kind of makes me angry. But he was so close and I couldn't get him. 
Oh, is this a jackrabbit? Where you going, rabbity? Come on, rabbity rabbit. Okay, my bad. I, I'm sorry I keep doing that. What is this? I'm used to dead space controls, so I keep wanting to run. Dude, come on. Calm down. Take a, take a deep breath. Am I hitting it? Hit that bitch in his goddamn horns? <laughs> I shot him his back ass leg. Ah, I did it again. I'm sorry. I'm to, sorry, I've been playing lots and lots of games, and I've just got dead space on my mind with this left, left bumper is fucking run, and it's just not. What the? Fifty experience. Okay. So, okay, I'm gonna hit it this time, but I'm gonna hit it on purpose because I need to, hopefully, see where it tells me to go. Like. Back to okay, up there is where totems totems destroyed. Okay, so that's an unlockable. Um, I'm guessing back this way is where I need to go to get back to my campsite. All right, so 50 experience points every time every time I kill a deer. So I'm gonna keep on doing that. Oh, here's another one. Oh, I'm out of. I'm out of, uh... Shit, there's deer everywhere, but I don't have any, uh... I'm out of arrows already. I'm using the shit out of them. Let's hope there's some more somewhere. we we'll keep our eyes open for more arrows, because... I am out! Out of arrows! Hey, I found some. Four arrows, yay! Four arrows! Just shoot some deer in the ass! Oh, this is where I was to begin with. That's where that dead body was hanging. I got my arrows and my, my bow and arrow! So I got my bow. All right, cool. So okay, so back there is where I need to go. Back up this way. All right, back to our campsite. Let's sit down real quick. All right, so we get our first look at the skill tree. Oh, so these are all survivors, survivor skills. All right, so those are all tier. What are these? So these are locked. I can't get to these. Oh, tier two. Okay, I got you. Animal instinct, keen observation allows you to spot hard to find animals. Okay, so here's hunt the hunter skill tree. Survivor and hunter, that's it. Okay. <laughs> Alright, toilet. Okay, so ammo capacity upgrade. Heavy lifter upgrade. This is strength allows you to carry the maximum amount of ammunition. Oh, hey. Yeah. Oh, I can't get that. Damn it. Alright, let's do... Steady shot. That feels, feels like we should do that just simply because... I suck at aiming at this point, so we'll go from there. <coughs> New skill mastered. Yay, awesome sauce. Alright, so let's go on next... Hunter upgrades, survivor upgrades. Okay, so hunter, survivor. There's camp. Skills. Okay, cool. Alright. 
captain of the Endurance. We are shipwrecked on an island inside the Dragon's Triangle. Ross, live. You're mm. alive. Oh, my coffee is cold as shit. Okay? What happened? I remember the beach, and then it went black, and I woke up in a cave. There was this crazy man, Ross, and a dead body. Oh, God. Where are you now, Lara? Are you safe? It was so horrible. It's all my fault. This is all my fault. Lara, listen to me. I sent an SOS from the Endurance before I abandoned her. Hopefully someone caught it. I've spoken to the others. We're regrouping at my location. Please come and get me. I have to stay here. You can do this, Lara. Remember when we climbed Snowden? You said the key was knowing that all you've got to do is just keep, keep moving. moving. Remember everything I've taught you, Lara. You're ready for this. And keep your radio on. Okay. All right, 150 experience points. All right, guys, let's go ahead and pause this right here. It sounds like a good place, if any. Uh, when we come back, we're going to move on towards uh, Roth and reunite with uh, with our crew. We're going to see what's going on with this music that just started up. Guys, so far, it's been a fantastic game. Guys, let's go ahead and smash some likes out for this. I really hope to get some views out of this, guys. Once again, if uh, this is your first time joining us with Inebriation Nation, please do leave me a comment. Let me know how you've come across the site. Also, let me know what you like and don't like about the videos. Um, that way, I could continue to grow and, and get better at these videos, guys. Um, in the meantime, y'all have a fantastical, magical day full of wonderful weather. May all your hopes and dreams come true. Don't forget to thank God every day. I feel yoga pants. So peace out.